All right, my scrubs, we're back with 98XX. The game that hacked my computer and is scaring me to death. I'm gonna go ahead and try to beat it this episode because I think it's not too long of a game. I thought it was longer than it actually was. But yeah, I want to read some of you guys' comments from last episode. Check it out if you missed it. This game really has some lore to learn about. And trust me, the lore gets deeper and deeper as you start to understand things from it. Yeah, I noticed. There's, there's a lot of things. Look at the creators here. Look at that. Nice. I'm assuming this is a creator. Hey, you... Hey, for hacking my computer, I'm so angry at you. Oh, they have videos. Oh, God. Should I be looking at your channel for some clues? I do remember that we got things in the photo editor. We have some numbers. Like, if we invert this, right? We got a 5, 5... Oh, wait, no, no, no. 7, 4, 9, 6, 1. I still don't know what to do with that. I'm assuming it's going to be a phone number. Then we got the 5, 5, 5. I don't... And also, these dice probably could mean something. But we still have to, I think, complete Tank Blast, which I guess we'll do right now. I didn't get a scary part with this game. I played it, but I didn't get no scariness. So, I'm assuming I need to get to, like, a high score and just lose this game really terrified me the knocking and the whispering in my ear got me so bad uh, yeah go watch it please if you enjoy seeing me in pain <laughs> and fear and that's the uh, that's the episode for you ah oh, game over wait wait is there not a scary part to this maybe it's not getting a high enough score i got 2400 Dude, all right, maybe there's just not scary things and everything all right. Well, all right. Let's try surfer I haven't tried that yet Oh, it's a web browser. The heck? Okay, um... In 1991, Bob Carter founded Razi Incorporated with a vision to revolutionize the computer chip industry. Okay. Today, Razi Incorporated has developed chips that are faster, smaller, and more power efficient than anything else on the market. Okay, are they are they able to trap human souls, though? Okay, what's this? Lyra's Incorporated has taken the world by storm with the launch of our newest computer, the 98XX. This cutting-edge device has been praised by tech experts and consumers alike for its ability to seamlessly run games, surf the there. web, and handle all other computing needs. So, how did Myra's Incorporated come to be the best computer company in the world? It all started with their partnership with Razi Incorporated, a leading software development company. Razi Incorporated provided Myra's Incorp. Oh, there's numbers! Ah, wait a minute! Four, five? Wait, 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 wait. Is there, is there other ones? Let's see. So we got four, six. Whoa, four, five, six. Okay, let's try that. No, did, did it not unlock anything? I am, like, tempted to go through every number and put it in here. Then we unlock everything. But you know we gotta try six, six, six. Oh, wow! Okay, that unlocked a lot. Jeez. Repent for your sins. I, no, I don't think I will. Oh, it's just all the same stuff. Oh, crap. Is something uh, bad about to happen? Where's the recycling bin? I'm gonna destroy talking Gerald and jumping Julian. All right, we haven't tried this either. The questions answer game. See how many questions you can answer. Do you like to play games? Yes. Do you think it's important to take breaks when playing too much? I guess. Do you think video games will take over the world? They already have, I would say. Have you played this game before? No. Are you sure you're playing a game? No. Do you know what reality is? N yes. Are you close with your family? Sure. Do you think even loved ones could hurt each other? Oh, yeah. If someone were to get into a fatal accident, would the death be painful? Y yes. People who do not repent for their sins are condemned. Oh, God. There it is again. Do you believe everything I say? Yes. Have you looked behind you? That's 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 very well timed. Was that you, Scrub Chen? Playing a good old prank on me. It was my that was very funny. Time is short. It's too late. Go ahead, go ahead, bring it on. Oh, it's Julian. Julian has taken over my computer. It's just <laughs> Okay. Okay. But you have to be so obnoxious about it. Okay, but that's not like a, not a full website though. Okay, you want me to go to the website, but like, but what? Oh God, I hate that man. I hate that crap. So is Julian the main character? Is Julian the child that couldn't stop playing the video games? What if I press control alt delete? The heck is all this? Let me guess, if I fill the screen up, something will happen. I want to say this is how paint used to be like. Like it was really pixelated. I mean, it still kind of is, but people will be drawing some masterpieces on these pixels, man. Am I wasting my time? Probably. Where's the paint bucket? Oh, what is this? Oh, is this an answer? I knew something was about that. I knew I knew I was doing something, I thought. All right, I, I'm going to take a picture of this. All right, puzzle patterns. Okay. All right, that's got to be it. Are you ready, guys? 
Something's about, something's gonna happen. Oh my god, the freaking jump scares are so bad in this game, man. They come out of nowhere. All right, this is Julian Snapchat. Like, what the heck is this? Oh, all right, we have another website. Well, same website, but it's a different video, it seems. Interview one. There we go. Greetings, Mr. Monkford. Mr. Nalto. Now, what made you decide to work at Rossi Incorporated? <laughs> the brilliance of a computer chip is always fascinating, me. Right? Even the human mind is something of a computer chip. If I'm not mistaken, you were the developer for Jumping Julian, which gained a lot of attention a few months ago. I mean, oh, is this Calvin Games? I did, but that was all in the past. I see. Oh, why don't we take five? We can discuss more a little bit later. Wait, was there anything else that I was supposed to know from this? So that was the guy. I'm. Uh, that was the guy that created Jumping Julian. I didn't see any like numbers or anything like that. Okay, what do we have here? WorldArticles.com. In recent months, a new game has taken the internet by storm, captivating the oh, attention of Julian. kids and adults alike. Jumping Julian, created by Dreamer Studios and developed by John Monkford, is a platformer game that has gained immense popularity in a short period of time. One of the game's biggest draws is its addictive gamma play. Jumping Julian is easy to pick up but difficult to master, making players want to keep trying until they beat a level. <laughs> it's However, like the worst game ever though. 789, okay. I see the code already. Okay, these, these codes aren't working, so there's got to be something else. Wait, this, these numbers are literally going in order. I just realized that. Yeah, 789. What the heck? Okay, so why would I need to put those 1, one through 9? I thought for sure that would work. Okay, um... Still don't know what to do with those numbers though. Okay, but we got 555 and we know that this doesn't work on the notepad thingy or the documents, but we have 555. Well, I don't think there's any numbers here. Oh, wow. Never mind. I take it back. Okay, so uh, 398. Okay, this is a number for sure. Okay, so 555 all right, connect that dial up. Dude, back then we thought this was the future. 39, 38, 78, oh. 78, 77, 6F, 72, 6C, 64, 2E, 63, 6F, 60, Dude, what are you saying? 2F, 39, 31, 31, 63, 6C, 73. Whoa, hold up. That was a long freaking number. Okay, uh, so I'm assuming we're gonna have to put that in the typewriter. All right, is that pencil gonna do something freaking weird? Yo, is this not it? I'm pretty sure this is right. Uh, I don't know what they want. Okay, well, we don't know the significance of that yet. Jump off the plant. To find the key that will set them all free. All right, let's go back to Jumping Julian and try to find a platform that we could jump off to find a key to set them free. Because that's what it said. I'm assuming there's got to be a secret. Nobody cares, Julian. Nobody cares. Can you imagine a child like seriously saying, "I can't stop playing this game. <laughs> I absolutely love this." Okay, so we have to go to level two. I swear I jumped off of every platform though, so I don't know what I did wrong. Okay. So on the left side, are they talk about the top? I swear I tried this. Yeah, see? Oh, what the heck is that? Bro, that stuff was not there before. I just randomly restarted the computer and opened it back up again. It's there? Did I not try that? Ah, uh, it's on the first level. They lied to me. Okay, we got the key. Now, what do we do with this with the key? Okay, that creepy face is still there. I don't freaking like it. Oh no! So now we go to jumping Julian, and I think we get to level two and jump off the screen. Oh, maybe they didn't lie to me. I just didn't understand it at first. Okay, so apparently it's supposed to be level two. Oh. Oh. 
What did that do? Okay, that creepy face is still there. Wait, did I not have the key? Oh, we're probably yeah. supposed to- Oh my god, they, this is like FNAF. What the heck? Bro, this is giving me major FNAF vibes. Oh, I gotta find a bunch of keys, don't I? Okay, there's another one. I just realized this is like in a shape of a cross, I think. Oh, what the? Okay. Hi. It is finished. Did I skip something? Well, whatever I did clearly didn't freaking just <laughs> take the devil off my computer. So I, I also found out that we have to get 2,500 points. Uh, I thought I did, but I, I, I think I did. But something is supposed to appear. Oh, there we go. There it is. Okay. What does this do? Forgotten memories. Okay. Oh, here we go. Okay. Uh, I think this might be copyright music. It's playing that really creepy, like, music, though. <laughs> that doesn't really uh, say anything. Okay. So this is just pictures of the websites, right? Okay. Is there anything else about this? Oh, okay. We have family. Is that the family that was in the wreck? Hi, Pie. All right. That creepy face is never going to go away, is it? I'm going to make a wild guess because it clearly says right here, the mother and the daughter, they died. And the dad, I'm assuming, is Calvin Games. And Julian and everyone keeps talking about, like, the afterlife and stuff. So I'm going to assume that has something to do. Like, maybe the dad wanted to, you know, bring back the kids somehow? I don't know. I, I really am just making a guess here. What? Okay, so I let all the audio play because I did read that if you read the, um, if you read these freaking things, it should give you a video. But I was like, but I did read them. But I did not do the whole voices. So, yeah, that was weird. Nothing weird. <laughs> okay, there it is. You just gotta wait for the... Okay, so we should hopefully have a video. Okay. Okay, I mean, uh, I don't even know if there's an actual ending. Uh, apparently the jumping Julian thing was supposed to be sort of an ending where we freed them because that's what the audio said, right? But I don't exactly know what that means. It says we need to repent for our sins, uh, but are we supposed to be the one that, that maybe killed people? And what, so what did they do to the chips to freaking, there's a lot. I don't know, guys. Leave your comments down below. I, I think I'm done. I really don't know. Uh, this game did get updated in October, so I wonder if it's going to get more updates in the future, so maybe it's not over. I don't know. I have no idea to, to know. And there's still, like, a number that I have, and I don't know what to do with it. So, yeah, I think I'm going to end it there, guys. So, yeah, very creepy, though. Today's script of the day goes to... Work not in progress. <laughs>